Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Welcome to the 25th lecture of English Grade 7. It's about unit number 7 exercise work. The first portion is of grammar, page number 38. Verbs. A verb is an action or a doing word that we use in different tenses. Verb kya hai? एक एक्शन वर्ड है या एक डूइंग वर्ड है जो किसी एक्शन को शो करता हो एक ऐसा वर्ड जो किसी एक्शन को शो करता हो مختلف टेंस में वो वर्ब कहलाता है द टेंस टेल्स अस व्हेन द एक्शन अकर अ वर्ब कैन बी यूज्ड इन पास्ट प्रेजेंट और फ्यूचर टेंस वर्ब से हमें पता चलता है कि एक्शन कोई काम कब वाकया हुआ है प्रेजेंट में है पास्ट में है या फ्यूचर में अदर टेंसेस इंक्लूड द पास्ट पार्टिसिपल एंड द प्रेजेंट पार्टिसिपल Past participle is actually the third form of verb and present participle is actually the fourth form that is ing form of the verb. The past participle is used to tell us that the action was completed. For example, I have spoken. The present participle is used to tell us that the action is still happening. For example, I am speaking. The continuity of action takes place in present participle. The continuity and progress of action takes place in present participle. Now, question number A is complete the following table. This is our past tense, hai, present tense, hai, future tense, hai, past, present participle hai, or past participle. Hai. The first one is done for you. I smiled. Past tense, I smile. Present tense, future tense is I will smile. Present participle, I am smiling. Past participle, I have smiled. Present tense में second number पर है I write तो इसका past tense होगा I wrote future tense होगा I will write present participle I am writing the process is still going on past participle I have written the process is completed now the second the third one is I cut past tense is I cut it is the three forms of this verb is the same cut 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 future tense is I will cut Present participle, I am cutting. Past participle, I have cut. The next one is choose. I choose. Present past tense is I choose. Future tense is I will choose. C-H-O-O-S-E. I will choose. Spelling mistake here. I am choosing. Present participle, I have chosen. Past participle. Similarly, the whole table is completed for you here. You have to read it thoroughly and learn okay you have to learn the whole table thoroughly with all the verbs given in the table this is your homework coming to question number b underline the verbs in each sentence write down the tense used in each case aapne verbs ko underline karna hai phir kya karna hai phir ye likhna hai ki ye kaun se tense mein hai you dropped your wallet on the ground dropped is actually second form of the verb so it is past tense i am baking a lovely chocolate cake for your birthday am baking the process still going on so it is present continuous the soldiers marched through the town after their victory marched means second form of the verb is used simple past asim hugs his mom every day before he leaves the house यहाँ पे हमारे पास वर्ब्स दो हैं हक्स और लीव्स और सिंपल प्रेजेंट में यूज हुए हैं। I visit my granny every evening on the way home from school. Visit यहाँ पे वर्ब है सिंपल प्रेजेंट है। I am knitting a head and scarf for my new born new baby sister. Am knitting the process is still going on so it is present continuous. I have left some money on the kitchen table for you for your bus fare. Have left third form of the verb is used. It is present perfect. I will uh, rinse the shampoo out of my hair. Will rinse means simple future. The robber has escaped from the prison. Has escaped present perfect. I will count to ten and then I will chase you. Will count or will chase. यहाँ पे हमारे पास verbs हैं और simple future tense use हुआ है. Now Write ten sentences. Write sentences using each of the verbs in the present participle from the table in exercise A. Exercise A में जो verbs दी गए हैं अनेक present participle में 
click link. This is your homework. Now coming towards coming towards the next page. It is also grammar work. It is grammar work. And it's page number 39. Page number 39. And it's grammar work. Dictionary work. The dictionary gives us lots of information about a word, including how to pronounce it and what part of speech the word is. Parts of speech include the following. Achai, dictionary mein jab hum kisi word ko talash karte hai, to wo na hum isme kuch ki meaning deta hai, balki hum ye bhi batata hai ki isko kis tarah pronounce karna hai, aur ye word kaun sa kaun se part of speech ki taur par use hua hai. Parts of speech mein kaun kaun se hai, noun hai, pronoun hai, adjective hai, verb hai, preposition hai, aur adverb hai. Question number eight. Use your dictionary to find out what part of speech each of these word is. Committee is noun. Effervescent is adjective. Increasingly adverb. Without preposition. Nightingale noun. Foreign adjective. Embrace verb. Nobody pronoun. Quasi adjective. Flatter verb. Nocturnal adjective. Sheikh noun. Punish verb. We are adverb. At preposition now coming to question b use your dictionary to help how you pick and ring the correct answer if something is effervescent it is effervescent ki meaning hai bulbuli chhodne wala so it is fizzy a flamingo is a type of bird if i have laryngitis where do i have an infection throat what would you do with a paella eat it Paella is actually Spanish dish of rice. Vermicelli is a type of type of pasta. A doctor of pediatrics take care of children. Where in a book would you find a prologue in the beginning? How is the disease rabies passed on? Biting. What might you find in quiver? Arrows. What would you do with a glockenspiel? Play it. It's a musical instrument. Question C. Use your dictionary to help you to match each word to its two different meanings. <coughs> Silly nonsense talk, waffle. Coat on a sheep, fleece. Small hollow in a wall, meat. Soil, earth. A member of the clergy, bishop. Small furry mammal, mole. Rubbish or waste. Refuse. Piece of cloth worn over shoulder. Sesh. A planet in the solar system. Earth. Small dark spot on skin. Mole. Flat cake made from the butter. Waffle. Cheat somebody of their money. Please. <coughs> Say you will not do something. Refuse. Comfortable suitable position. Need. Window frame that slides on a roof. Sesh. Chis peace bishop. Now coming towards the next page. The next page that is page number 40. It's about word study. Word study. Comprehension. Question number 8 is comprehension. Idioms are interesting. Description. Match the, uh, match the idiom to its meaning the one is the one is to be tickled pick means very amused make somebody's day means make a person happy spread like wildfire spread quickly not the foggiest means take blame for what others did the last straw means no idea. Question number B is, vocabulary question number B is, rewrite the lines from the winter poems in another way. He gives his harness, builds a shake, he rings the bills on his straps. Whose words these are, I think I know. I know the honor of the words. You will get the thrill, you will enjoy it. They really stand still, they mostly walk. They walk where they will. They can go everywhere. Question number C is word structure. Ring the correct spelling of the each word. 
in the first one the first is correct put put number 2 make m a k e make last one number 3 the second one s t r w e e street number 4 the first one p e o p l e number 5 the second word brother b r o t h e r number 6 slowly s l o w l y number 7 against a g a i n s t the first one number 8 mistake m i s t a k e the second one number 9 sensitive s e n s i t i v e the second one number 10 wednesday w e d n e s d a y wednesday number d <coughs> think plain write use the plain in the vocabulary write an essay on the topic snowed in at school hints are here keywords are here you have to write the essay yourself now coming towards the next page that is check up page number 41 check up question number a is vocabulary vocabulary write the words that made the description words ending with sat please make happy satisfied small type of orange fruit set soma goes around a planet saturn wet through saturate old dam of school bag satchel no words ending with double e n in the middle of two things between two less than 2018 glass at the front of a card screen usually found with a king queen eager king now question number b comprehension based on information from the winter poems are these sentences true or false in the poem it is raining false the horse is wearing bell true the lake is frozen true it is the longest day of the year false the woods are dark and deep true most walk wherever they like true they come into your house at night true most is a large deer true most prefer warm weather false they found in parts of europe true question number c is grammar complete the table with the present and past past participles i have already done in in the table this work has been done in the table just read it and try to understand okay question number d proofing underline the 10 errors and write the correction about the error this work has also done mistakes are being pointed out you have to read it thoroughly write the exercise work in your rough notebook and try to learn it Thank you.